I just finished my previous recording and I'm already seeing another brute in the desert. Please be a storm touched one. Let's see. I cannot see it. Please be purple. No, it's not. Uh, it's probably the same one. Dang it. All right. Hold up. Wait. You're not the same. This one has purple in it. What the heck? I thought it was the same one again. It's the exact same spot. I mean, exactly the same spot. Guess it's not the same one. All right. All right. I guess we're jumping into this. Did I even say hello yet? Good day. Good day, Dino friends. Hang on. I need to deal with three things at once. Good day, Dino friends. I hope you're having a good day. Welcome to... Welcome back to LEGO Fortnite. I'm being under attack. I'm being attacked by many monsters. Did you kill the... Okay, he killed the scorpion. Okay, that's good. He's gonna take my time. Gonna take my time to aim as many of these... Um, of these uh, arrows into headshots. Because, you know, then they hit double... And that means I save an arrow. <laughs> I guess I could probably make a bunch of them as well. Because I have a bunch of feathers now. Nope. Come on. I'm trying to get like... <laughs> a headshots only kill. Just because I'm a cheapskate when it comes to arrows. Just being very slow about this. Nope. How is it now a different one? How is it not the same one? I don't know. I didn't kill the other one. Ow! That's not good. Okay, don't worry about it. I have an automatically healing charm. So that's good. If I really don't get hit for a little while... It should automatically heal me to full. It takes some time though, but... But I dodged... I, I rolled! I rolled though! Dude, I rolled! I was rolling! No! <laughs> okay, is he still going to be half health if I go back there real quick? Okay. Yeah. Okay, maybe I should not have waited for the totem to heal me. Uh, wrong. I should not have waited for the totem to heal me, should I? Okay. Let's go back as fast as we can. And see if he's still there. If his health is still going to be half if we get back. I really hope so. Because I'm an arrow cheapskate. I want my I want my arrows to come back to me. I want to spend as few arrows as possible, and if I miss them, I want to go and pick them all up. <laughs> Which you can do in this game, by the way. For those who don't know. What? Bro. I have no beef with you. Okay, where was he? Look, it's one of my missed arrows. <laughs> Pick it up. <laughs> I need it. <laughs> Guys, shout if you see any more uh, arrows. Okay, where is the brute? Where did it go? It was here. Uh, do you think it despawned because I died? Oh no, dude. Come on. Where could it have gone? Where did I fight it? It was here. It was like right here. You're telling me it despawned because I died one time? I only had one time? I, died, I, I had one tiny little death. Who cares about that? Who cares? Who cares? Whoa, who's shooting at me? How do you see me? That guy sees me from far away. What the heck? I'm being hunted. From like the other side of the planet. Okay, I think the brute disappeared. Okay, I'm having some setbacks here. I thought this was going to be a smooth fight, but... 
I rolled aside though from that brute. That's the thing. I did roll aside like I keep doing every time. Like this, you just roll to the side. And for some reason that one time it didn't work. To be fair, sometimes dodging doesn't work. Like, randomly. I'm not very lucky with it. I don't know why it happens. But sometimes you just roll to the side or backwards and you still get hit. And I don't know how that works. I don't, I don't understand how it works. Okay, uh, I think we're gonna have to wait for it to respawn. Hopefully as a, a hardcore version. Because I think this is the main spot where brutes spawn. I've only really seen them in this exact spot. So I think they just keep spawning in the same spot. I think that's probably how the game just works. Uh, but sometimes I see them closer to the water. So I'll check that out real quick. Hello, Star Wars guy. Don't shoot at me, please. No, don't shoot at me. Maybe there's one here. I've seen them here as well. Where kind of the grass and the beach and the desert meet. But there isn't one now, I think. Okay, I'll go down the beach. I've seen them here. Well, I'm not finding it right now. I'll be back when I, I guess, find it again. <sighs> ah, come on. Wow. Wow. Okay, so I just went to the lobby, switched my skin back to this one. This is the lucky skin that I got the other brute kill with. And guess what? I log back in, instantly I see one. This skin is really lucky. This is really my leg, my lucky Lego skin. Okay, before I fight him, I gotta fight this one. Then I've gotta check if I have everything that I need. I should have brought one of those um, mushroom potions. I think those heal you faster or something. I don't think they give health instantly, but they sort of make you heal faster over time or something. I don't know exactly. Okay, we have 119 arrows left. We have used up so many. Hopefully it will be enough. Come on, I'm dodging. I'm dodging. Okay, that time it counted. Okay. Dodging. I do have a shield. Maybe that would also help. I feel like an attack from him would instantly destroy the shield. That's how strong the attacks are, aren't they? I don't know how much the shield... No, I cannot keep up the shield and roll at the same time, right? I guess I can keep up the shield up until he runs past and then dodge to the side. So in case the game considers me to dodge too late... It would maybe still count the shield. Okay, that might work actually. Okay, 100 arrows. Okay, if we keep this up, we might be able to get our kill. If we get this kill... I'm just gonna get... I'm just gonna speedrun the desert village. And just get it to level 10 in one episode. Just use the... Um, what was it? The lumber mill trick? Come on, Just stay focused. It's all about staying focused. Staying calm, because his attacks are really not that hard to dodge, I said, as I was getting hit quite hard. Okay. Oh no, I ran into the green thing again! Oh, I'm the worst at this game, I'm the worst player. I'm officially the worst player at this game. Okay, what are you? Are you Storm? Or not storm. Yes! Okay, found another one. Found another one. I'm not ready yet. I'm not ready. Wait, 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 wait! Oh my god. Okay. I wasn't ready yet. I was- I didn't think it was purple. I didn't think it was the purple guy. Okay, so I just went to my base. This is way closer to my base. Obviously, I just died. I made a bunch more... Totems? Oh god. 
Come on, give me a break. Give me a break. I'm not done yet. I'm not ready yet. <laughs> hang on, hang on. I don't think he will follow me into the grasslands. Okay, made a bunch of new totems. I realized making arrows is way cheaper than I thought. I've been spending this entire video and the last video, I think, was this video or the last one, saying that I want to save all of my arrows. Guess what? They, if you have one feather and wood, you can make eight arrows. I thought one feather and one wood would make one arrow, but it makes eight. So you only need like 10 feathers and wood to make an entire stack of arrows. So that means I can make hundreds, probably thousands of them. All right, so maybe this skin is not that lucky after all. But we'll see. We'll do one more try. Okay, first I gotta try this pizza. It says it heals 25, so it's probably not gonna do anything. But what if it adds 25 hearts? It probably isn't gonna, like, add 25 hearts. But just in case. I've never eaten a pizza in this game before, so... I mean, it did... It did give me something. It did give me something. Um, then this potion heals as well over time. That's a healing over time effect. And this one gives you infinite energy. Not infinite. It gives you a bunch of energy for uh, a short amount of time. Okay. I forgot about the heat. The berry helps with the heat. All right. I'm losing health. Oh, because I was hot for a second. Okay, the only thing is that my crossbow is now like... Halfway done, but I think it should be possible. Okay, here we go again. If I die this time, I'm gonna switch skins. I'm not... <laughs> I thought this was my lucky skin. I thought this was supposed to be my lucky skin. There was something behind me I sc that scared me because <laughs> I couldn't back up and he was about to smash me into pieces. Into Lego pieces. Ooh, dodge that. Yeah, can you kill that scorp- Oh, that's not a scorpion, it's a chicken. Don't kill the chicken. Be nice to the chickens. Do the desert chickens give anything good? Because I know the ice valley... Um, Sheep give a better type of wool. They give heavy wool. The ice... I don't know what ice place is called. The ice place... Whoo, sheep give a heavy wool instead of regular wool. And that's better. <laughs> Why am I so distracted? Just talking to you guys. As long as it's working, right? Ah! There was something behind me. I, that scared me again. <laughs> I keep getting backed up into a corner. I want to turn around. Missed me. Come on, he's almost halfway. Tell me this time. My health is so big, though. Ah, what am I backed up to? Oh, once again, a, it's a giant rock. Oh, God! Didn't mean to do that! <laughs> I accidentally stepped in the... Uh, Okay, sir. Come on. Be my lucky skin, please. I like this skin. I want it to be my lucky skin. But if I die, I'm gonna switch skins again before I try again. Ah! Okay, that was very close because I was trying to run in between the two green spots. Where are you going? Oh god, it's one of those guys. Ah! The cre they're basically the creepers of um, Lego Mike or Lego Fortnite. I'm sorry? Did he just give up on me? Oh. It looked like he just sorta of gave up. He just was like they are too far away. Yeah. It's like I'm out of reach for him. 
Come on. Did I bring any backup weapons? Because this one is so close to being broken. I might have to go in with the lightsaber. Which I really don't want to do. That's way too close to comfort for me. His health has got to be so low. Yeah, but he's kind of stuck now. I actually need him to... Come at me now because... Ah! Whoa, that didn't hit me? Okay, cool. Because I can get more headshots if he's actually facing me. Come on. If he's spitting so much... I'm way more likely to get hit by the stupid poison spots that the spit leaves behind. Okay, come on. He's got like one health. Are you kidding me? Is this my victory dance? Stomp, stomp, stomp. Jump, jump, jump. I can't believe it. Okay. My crossbow has like two shots left in it. I didn't think that having a half health uh, crossbow would be a problem. But it almost ran out. Let's see how many shots it has left. Two. Three. It only had three uh, shots left in it. If I had... Shot. If there were like three of those, no wait, four of those headshots that weren't headshots but regular. Wait, did I pick up the skill? Oh yeah, I got it. The brute skill. What can I make with sand brute skills? I don't know. Okay, so I'm very happy about the fact that we did that. Uh, I'm going to see if we can... Oh god, ow! Use that tutorial that I once watched, which basically said... You can pretty easily level up a village. All you have to do is just put a ton of uh, lumber mills. I think that person just put like a ton of lumber mills. And then the village was just complete. If we can, if I can do that, let's, let's try that out. There's that silver, silver llama this time. All right, I guess they come in silver, gold and normal, I guess. Those are the ones that I found. Hey, come back here. Am I full? I'm not full at all. I was just... I was actually just sorting my... Uh, storage room. So I should have a lot of space. So basically, in order to build a lumber mill... You need... 8 wood and 15 granite. So basically, almost twice as much granite... As you have wood. Should I just bring like a hundred... Like enough to build a hundred of these. How many do you need? I have absolutely no idea. What direction am I going? Oh, this is totally the wrong direction. Oh, there's another brute. No, I'm done with you, buddy. I'm done with you. Unless if it turns out that I need those brute skills that they drop for something. To craft something. There's a fair chance that will happen. In which case I'll have to kill another one. But also I realized... Like, super late into the challenge. That I don't even have an enchanting table yet. Like, I could just put, like, extra damage or extra durability on my crossbow. Like, so in this game, every weapon and tool has, like, three slots. So I could put three times either durability or extra damage. I don't know if I have enough materials, though, to do that, because uh, I think enchanting is kind of expensive. I don't know. I have, as I said, I completely forgot it existed, so I haven't been doing it. I guess when I fight the Ice Brute, I will definitely enchant. I'll probably try to get a better crossbow made out of the best material I can find, because this is the... Yeah, this is the rare one. So let's see if we can at least get the epic one. Or, alternatively, we bring all of these bow casters. <laughs> they basically shoot an explosive. Sadly, they all have only a few charges. And switching weapons mid-fight is extremely hard. So I don't think that's going to work. That would be epic, though. Just shooting explosives at it non-stop. Kablamo! Okay, I'll be, I'll be back. 
All right. No. No. <laughs> Where's Bright? What did you do to Bright? What did you do to Bright? Dang it. <laughs> I wanted Bright to be here. Bright left because I didn't have a bed. <laughs> no. I brought so much wood. I brought, I brought I brought so much wood and so much um, stone, so I should be able to place a bunch of lumber mills. The only problem is the space, of course. There's not much space here. Let's see. Let's upgrade the village. Does it, is it going to ask me? Oh, it is going to ask me for a bunch of other stuff as well. Okay, that's a problem. Okay, at least... Okay, I need not root plank. Okay, I'm going to look at the list of everything that I need and bring it over here. Okay, first off, look at how good the sword looks right now. Look at it. Yes, I forgot to bring my uh, torches. I forgot to bring my torches. I'm a little bit cold, but look at how cool the sword looks. Second thing, I just looked at a full list of everything you need in order to upgrade a village in a desert to level 10, and I don't have all the stuff. So I'm going to need to go into a desert cave. Are we going to do that in this video? I don't know. I feel like these videos keep getting longer. But in this video, I kind of... No, I, I said in the last video that I would do this. So you know what? I'm just going to cut it out. I'm just going to cut out most of the grinding and just show you the highlights and come back when I've got like all the stuff. But first, I've got to go to this cave and get enough ruby and obsidian and stuff like that. So yeah, see you in a bit, I guess. Oh my god, I've been like completely, I, com I completely forgot I even had, um, I even had my recording still going, on paused, <laughs> on paused mode, I completely forgot because it has been taking so, it's been such a pain to get through this cave in order to get this uh, ruby over here. Uh, finally, I have enough, but I see some more. Without enemies, these enemies are really strong. And they come at you with about nine at the same time. Can I stand on this? Eee? Okay. They come at you with so many at the same time. So, I've died like three times. I am now... I know this is going to sound like an excuse, but I am 100% convinced there is a bug somewhere. Because two out of the three times that I died was because I just couldn't move. I was just completely stuck. So unless, unless if there is some kind of um, stunned, stunning mechanics that I don't know about, maybe those exist. Maybe that's what happened. Um, otherwise, I don't know what happened. I was like completely unable to move two times. And yeah, it's really annoying because basically I do nothing wrong. I'm like dodging perfectly. And then the game's just like, nah. Just doesn't count the dodge and just forces me to stand still and get beat up, which is not fun. <laughs> That's like, I'm being bullied by Lego right now. Should we make this a clickbait video? Just make the title Lego is bullying me. <sighs> How am I going to get down there? Okay, should we do a reverse stair? I'm going to do a reverse staircase. Okay, that's not a great spot, actually. I'm going to do a different reverse there. I'm going to do this one. And then I'm going to move it closer. Okay. Anyway, after spending several eternities in this cave, dying multiple times, absolutely suffering... Oh, now I'm stuck at the lava. Well, you can get an idea of how this has been going. Um... I think I'm finally done. I'm finally ready. Oh, this costs plastoid? Oh, well, I'm going to put it anyway. I don't have granite left, probably. Okay, that's fine. I'm actually not that far from the end. But there's just so many enemies. And yeah, it would be cool to get a third lightsaber. Maybe we could make that one of the goals... Not today, though. This has been so painful. As you can see, there's no way to beat the heat. Um, I'm going to need to make a charm for that that cools me down. Because I'm using these berries to cool me down. And, of course, I'm not wearing the torch, which makes me warmer as well. So I took away the torch. I'm eating the food that makes me cooler. Still isn't enough. Anyway, I found a picture on the internet. I think I already said this. I don't know, because it's been so long. I've been I've been in this cave for forever. 
Um, but I found an image that shows exactly what you need to complete the village. So I'm going to fill my inventory with exactly everything I need to complete the village. And we're going to see if it's going to work. We're going to see if it's going to work. I do see images of like a part of a castle. So if we need to build that, that's going to be pretty hard on top of a giant mountain. Uh, in the middle of the desert. So I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I guess we'll just have to build a bunch of extra floors around it and hope they don't collapse. And yeah, just hope for the best. <laughs> okay, this video is getting too long. Uh, I'll see you when I've got all the materials. Yeah, I'm back. I'm back. I'm back again. Oh my god, it's 10 p.m. It is so late. Theoretically, I now have exactly everything. I collected everything. These things, these rubies, they take half a minute each to cut so i have 45 of them that's over tw 20 minutes right there okay it's fine it's fine it's fine it's fine it's fine i'm just going to quickly build a village to level 10 and it's gonna be fine and it's not going to break or fall off this mountain for sure don't worry about it don't worry about it that is something that's definitely not going to happen um I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just putting floors everywhere. Never use your pickaxe because then everything will fall down probably. I don't know. Okay, we're just going to assume we have everything we need. Let's upgrade to level two. No, three. Okay, let's upgrade to level. Okay. Let's see. So we need to get more village stuff. So I'm going to put another lumber mill, like the, that one tutorial said. Just put a just put a bunch of lumber mills. It says, okay, come on, level four. Go. All right, what do I need now? More lumber mills. That's fine. I took like a bunch of, of stuff, so I can make it. I can. I should be able to make about 50 lumber mills. Oh my god! If this is not gonna work. Dude, I've been recording, if you count the time that I was in that cave, plus the time that I was just collecting all that stuff. I don't know, this video is like a five hour video or something. Okay, level five. Let's go. Uh, what now? More lumber mills. <laughs> More lumber mills. I ended up not needing lumber mills that much for my original village. The Star Wars village, you know, because I've been working on the castle and it has so many chests in it for storage. So all of that counts towards the village, you know, the village point, I guess, rating. So I didn't need to put all of these. Okay, upgraded. Come on. Yes, we have enough to upgrade it again. Let's go. Level seven. Ah, more, more, more lumber mills. <laughs> more lumber mills. Then I'm just putting above... The bottomless void. Please. Okay, the game says you are hot. Okay, don't no need no need to hit on me, okay? I'm just trying to play a game. Okay. More granite. More granite. <laughs> oh my god. Come on, we should be able to do this. Please, let me build this village. We're so close to level 9. So level 9, come on. Please. Okay, how many of these do I need now? Wrong one, wrong one. Why am I that hot? Okay, hang on. Let me just eat a berry. Oh, and take off the torch. That should help with the hotness. Come on. So close, level 10. One more? Two more? One more, I think. I think we're like 1% off. We're like 1% off, level 10. Okay, come on. Level 10? Okay, hang on. Ooh, got new recipes as well. Okay, get me the quest. Level 10 village? Okay, at the top right, you can now see the quest that says interact with a level 10 village. Okay. Boom, level 10. Okay, how do I interact with it, though? How do I interact with it? Do I set this as my bed? 
set count is inter what counts as interacting? I don't even remember what I did in the grasslands. I just realized this this outfit kind of looks like that girl from Spider-Man. Okay, how do I interact with this village? What if I use some of the wood to make some planks? Does that count? I don't know what counts and what doesn't count. I also don't know where Mr. Tomato Head went because he probably fell off the mount. Oh, never mind. There he is. Can I interact with him? Does that count? That should count. <gasps> Did it count? I talked to him, though. Okay, let's have an entire conversation. Let's give him, like, a job and stuff. Maybe that could count. Let's talk jobs. Um, smelt metal. Which doesn't make any sense because we don't have anything. To smelt with? Okay, that doesn't count. What counts? What counts as interacting? I keep getting recipes, though, so that's pretty cool. I keep getting more recipes. Um, what counts as interacting? Was it farming? Is that what I did in the last village? I don't know. What if I put it... What if I build something in it? I mean, it's level 10. Is it not level 10? It is level 10. It worked. Okay, so putting a fire work. There we go. There we go. There it is. All right. I'm just going. I'm going home for the last time. This video is over a half an hour long for you guys. And for me, it's like five hours long <laughs> because I spent way too much time in that, um, in that cave. I really should learn what the hotkeys are to record, so when, if anything happens, I don't have to, like, pause the game, switch to the other screen to record. But I can just instantly, if there's any action, I can just instantly record. That would be pretty awesome. Alright, okay, I'm gonna assume we need the same material, which was marble. For the other... Statue? Okay. You. Okay, we'll put that one on that side. Alright, let's see. Nope, it needs other material. Copper bars. Okay, okay, okay. I have those. I have those somewhere. Somewhere I have those. Alright, look at this. Yes. There it is. I know, I agree. Oh, you're looking at the wrong thing. Hey, you're looking at the wrong thing. Look at this statue. All right, fine. Okay, so it has like a little v mini version of the desert. As you can see, it has cacti and stuff. Looks really cool. And then once again, it has this monster that I don't know what it is because it doesn't look like a brute. So I don't know. So one more to go, guys. I'm not going to tell anymore like, oh, I'll try to do it within this video because apparently life doesn't always happen the way you plan. And then I end up having to make a 33 minutes and 25 second video. So that's very long. <laughs> So yeah, I'm of course going to end the video here because it's also pretty late and my neighbors can probably hear me. Maybe they're in bed. Maybe they're doing that face of that one meme. Oh, what's the meme? You know the meme of the guy who's trying to sleep and then he wakes up and he looks into the light? Yeah, that's that's my neighbors right now hearing me record this while they're trying to sleep. <laughs> At least that's what I imagine. That's why I usually don't record this late. So I'm going to end the video here. In the next video, well, I'm, I'm hoping before I even record the next video to put make a lot of progress to the castle. I'm just going to make it um, this part way bigger, like three floors higher. And that's going to be one, a tower. And then we'll have another one there, there and there. And we'll have four towers and then a middle part that's going to be uh, slightly less tall. That's what I'm picturing right now. And I'm working so much on these quests that I haven't been working on the castle. So I want to finish the castle, but yes. Next time... Well, probably not in the next video, but we got to prepare to fight one of the strongest creatures that exists in the entirety of LEGO Fortnite. Which is the hardcore version, the storm-touched version of the Frostlands Brute. 
I have no idea how hard it's going to be. I feel like the desert one wasn't that much harder than the grasslands one, other than having a lot more health. It did also, it does do more damage, but it didn't feel faster. So it feels like, it felt like I could dodge its attacks quite easily. Um, I know I died to it a few times, but we're not going to talk about that. Um, the thing about the frost lands is, is that I can just not, almost never go there without taking damage instantly from how cold it is. So I'm going to need to make some charms for that. Let's see. Inner fire charm, I guess. Is that the best one that I have? Okay, inner fire charm. I guess I'm going to have to make one of these? Or do you need multiple of these? I don't know. And honestly, I feel like when we're fighting the Froze Brood, it would be really cool. Since it's like the end fight of this video series, right? It's going to be like the end boss of this challenge. It would be really cool if... We just use up all of our really strong weapons that I've, we've been finding. Like, these detonators, they are so strong, these bombs. Um, I've got a ton of these bow casters now. I have, like, six now. They are they don't have that many charges in them. But they do a lot of damage as well. It's basically a crossbow that shoots an explosive. Um, I just want to use up all that stuff. Because, really, when else are we going to use it? Okay. Anyway, I really have to end this video. I really, I don't know what's wrong with me. This video is too long. Yeah, arrest me. Okay. Um, I'll see you guys. Oh, the fire respawned. Okay, if anyone remembers, and I don't even know if this was in this video because this video is so long. But I think in the last video, I put this floor thingy here to see if this fire would still come back. And the fire still came back. Wait, does it not matter what I build? What if I build a giant tower here? Will a fire still spawn on top of it? Should we test that? Should we just build a tower all the way to the sky? <laughs> okay, I keep getting distracted. I have to end this video. It's so late. I haven't eaten enough yet. I haven't had dinner yet. It's 10 p.m. All right, that's normal. That's Don't worry about that. That's normal. I'm going to end this video here. Thank you guys so much. If you have watched this entire video all the way to the end from start till end you are a real one uh leave a comment saying i don't know we need to find a message we need to do like a secret message so i can see your comment and know you've watched the whole video okay if you've watched the whole video to the end comment um oh this is not penny comment penny is a cute little piggy where is penny I don't know where my pig is. I just saw her running around. Okay, just comment. A penny is a cute little piggy. That's the name of the pig, by the way. But the only animal I have because my sheep died, sadly. Uh, oh, I hear a sheep over there. I can. I'm going to tame it after I end this video. I'm going to tame it. It will be. It will be. Uh, uh, Bitsy number two. Okay. Really ending this video. Really ending this video. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. Thank you for being here. Um, thank you to Patreon and YouTube members. Um, Green Thunder and Carl. Thank you, everyone who supports me in any way. If you like the video, if you subscribe, if you watch on Twitch, if you play my Roblox games. Any way that you support me, thank you so much. Uh, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to stomp like a dinosaur. Stomp. 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 Stomp and T-pose. Lol. <laughs>